Taurus. So this is going to be a reading just for Taurus singles who are not connected with anybody. Not really, look at that, the Hierophant there, that's your card. Not really connected with anybody, um, but is open to love, okay? Completely single Tauruses. What's going on with Taurus for November 9th through the 16th? What are their options in love? Please show me. Four of Wands. I saw the High Priestess there using your intuition to make decisions that are best and right for you. All right. So here we go, Taurus. Let's see what's going on with Taurus and what options and love do they have for November 9th through November 16th? Now the strength card, possibly a Leo coming towards you. Okay. Saw the Ace of Cups. And I just cut and saw the Ace of Cups again. A lot of you guys are just really wanting your own stability, like within yourself. You know, just want to stand your ground and do what it is that, that is best for you. I just did Aries. And Aries first card out was the Six of Swords. Going, just coming out of something that was very, very um, hard for you to deal with. And now trying to go towards something that is, is better suited for you here. But you have somebody coming towards you, a fire sign, possibly Sagittarius, but it could be, um, uh, Leo, like I said before, or Aries as well, or just somebody that has um, that kind of energy that they're exhibiting, that fiery energy, okay? Um, and it seems like they are coming towards you and they are willing to bear the burden of being with you. So, Tar Singles, I feel like this is not somebody new. This is somebody that you have been involved with before. For them to feel like and know that, you know, there's certain things that that you guys may have to face in order to be together. This is somebody that all that is already um you know, knows you. They know about you. They know, you know, how the relationship was before. So this, this feels like, you know, somebody from your past coming back here, actually with this 10 of wands, somebody that has gone through a transformation, you guys separated before, or either this person just came out of something and, and possibly a karmic situation that they were involved in themselves and they put an end to that, whatever it is, they have transformed and I feel like they are coming towards you as a different person. If this is somebody from your past here, yes, 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 yes. Fast communication, again, uh, Sagittarius energy here, Sagittarius Scorpio, or somebody that is like on that cusp, whether it's the sun sign, the rising sign, the moon sign, um, I'm just going to give you guys a little tidbit of information that, and a lot of people don't like me talking. I've, I've seen it in the comments, but I just have to say this. Okay. The signs, I call the signs out because a lot of people like to hear them, but at the same time, we all can exhibit certain aspects of each zodiac sign at any given time guys so i i prompt you to just kind of i'm very into astrology as well but i prompt you to just kind of look make sure you uh, get your chart know where your placements are know where certain signs are in certain houses and it will give you a lot of insight into the people that you encounter, the people that you meet, and the people that you deal with, okay? So I'm just going to leave it at that. But anyway, fast communication, I feel like this person has been, um, I just feel like they have been looking at you for a while, okay? And I feel like they didn't know how to really approach you. And so I feel like it's a lot of um, online communication 
that has been happening you have encountered this person I am sh almost positive you probably don't even know it though you probably don't know it um, because they haven't made contact with you yet I don't feel they're coming towards you and I feel like you're going towards them too and you probably don't even know it okay because the energy is bringing you guys together because this person probably was not for you before they probably weren't vibing at the same energy you know as you were okay so they're coming towards you a different person here and I feel like you're going to um, it's gonna be communication that is is fast it's gonna be out the blue um, you're not going to even see it coming is what I feel here you have the ten of swords with the page of swords you have you have been betrayed um, and you have been hurt you I feel pain I, I really do I, I feel I just got this this feeling and chills all over my body um there's two tens here endings somebody really hurt you and I feel like you have a lot of air in your chart or either you're like on the cusp of like Taurus Gemini um, energy here I feel like and it could be in your um, rising moon um, Venus Jupiter you know depending on whether or not you're male or female um, Jupiter is the husband okay so if you didn't know um, and that's why I usually say Venus and Jupiter but anyway you have been hurt you feel stabbed in the back but I feel like you're done and over that because you're moving towards calmer waters okay <clears throat> And you may also have been, um, you know, looking at this person. But I feel like you're not looking at this person. Like, as far as online, you probably still think about this person. And I think that I feel like you, whatever it is you need to say, you're almost expecting this person to come back. And you're ready. You realize some things from being, from filling all these sores here. That's my ice maker for you guys here. Um, you realize some things with this page of swords here. Page of swords really does not speak a whole lot. Um, they just, they, they observe and um, they realize certain things. They are a student. They learn. They, they explore. And you have come to a place where you're done and over with the Ten of Swords here. And I'm not so sure if this person comes back that you will be, you know, welcoming here. Because this definitely looks like somebody that is from your past is coming back here. Strong Sag Scorpio energy. Sagittarius again Aquarius Aquarius and Sagittarius is, and Scorpio is strong here um, I, this this connection right here even though you guys aren't together the two major iconic cards are sitting right under each other The person that's coming towards you needed to go through some things. They needed to have a transformation. They needed to see things in a different light. They probably were real stubborn before and just wanted things their way.
They probably said things that hurt you. They probably took below the belt shots at you a lot of the time. Because I almost, I feel like the energy is kind of reversed with this person because this person is coming towards you with this Sagittarius Scorpio energy. I feel like you were more fiery when you guys were together. And they were more in like the swords energy where, you know, they were very verbal and very, um, you know, played mind games a lot. But now you're in this source energy and not so willing to take action towards them. You're just kind of observing and knowing what it is that you will take and what you won't take at this point. So I feel like, you know, you're just balancing out. You probably were very emotional before too. There are no cups here. So I feel like, you know, you remove that. But there is a, there's a need to balance out um, because we have to have cups. That's love, okay? There's a need to balance out um, the energy. Cups, earth, um, pinnacles, you know, and, and fire, action. You know, all of those things need to come into play and be balanced out for, I feel like, for a relationship to stand on solid ground. You know, it has to be like a nice balance there. And I feel like you're doing that. I feel like you're doing that. And I feel like you're defending, defending what it is that you believe here. I feel like you're defending your sanity, actually. Because I, you put up with a lot of... of of stuff from this person in the past so yeah you do have an option Taurus somebody from your past okay so that's what I have for you guys for November 9th through the 16th and I will be speaking with you